Previously on The Potentialists. What does ATV even stand for? Altering vehicle. Zero points to gaze. That's just because you're a fairy. She is a witch. I fought her and fought her and fought her. I have no idea what fought her, fought her, fought her is. There's one thing I'll never be able to teach anyone, is a man's work. I'm making a conscious choice to do it. You have a full day of sexy lips. You ready? Set. Vlog. I have to be honest, Serge lately, he has been keeping his word on everything and he's growing, he's doing really good. However, in this instance, he decided to keep his word and wear the lipstick. Ba -da -da -da. Ah, thank you. <sighs> I had forgotten about this. This is self-imposed, by the way. I'm doing this to myself, I'm messing up. I think it's too late. I gotta get you a redder one. I'm wearing lipstick. Not because I'm a cross-dresser, it's not because I like to wear lipstick. I had a deal with my mentor and friend, Bert, that I would make 15 calls every day. Yesterday, we ran into a few hiccups because I messed up. It's a humbling experience at any age. When you mess up, you just have to take ownership of it and do the best you can and move on. This is only half my punishment. At some point, LJ will come in and make me do push-ups. I feel like a little old lady. Why? That's a lipstick mark that I left on my glass. I love your lips. No. <laughs> no. You say no? You say no? <laughs> but then Sabrina walked in and she decided that Serge should not just wear the lipstick, that he should grow some hair. Can I dress up again? No, no, you can't do it. <laughs> come on, it's gonna be cute. Put a on there. I'm not gonna, I'm really not gonna No, man, hey, come on. I wanna make you look cute. Okay, knock you yourself out. Baby. But make sure I can take that shit off. Nothing I permanent, know. bro, you know. So she drew some hair on him. Oh, okay. Okay. Savvy and Infinite Wisdom wanted to give me hair. So this is a new product for all you people that are follically challenged. As you can see, now you can have hair. Oh, jeez. You should give me sideburns. <laughs> a beauty mark? Aww. And a unibrow. <laughs> Don't put me by an open flame. I might spontaneously combust. <laughs> And boy, he ended up looking like Andrew Dice Clay. Crap, I look like a really bad Elvis. I like the unibrow, it's very good. I got in touch with my feminine side. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> it's a new form of hair coverage it's called couvering. <laughs> Nobody can send me. Open your mouth. Listen, Egg Fu Young, I'm gonna get you back later on. Don't worry about it. Hi, I'm Helga. <laughs> I'm from the German weightlifting team. Me and the girls will be going to the bar later. What led up to these events? Well, I'll tell you. Bert left for a couple of days and left us to our own devices. He wasn't around to supervise the activities. I have to do push-ups because I failed to do what I needed to do. But Sabrina came in through the door and I knew there was trouble on the horizon. And she has this really sick smile on her face. It's just, hey, I want to put hair on you. And what do I do, like the fool that I am? I said, sure. In life, if you don't want to be a fool, do what you need to do, and you won't be like this. That's my story. Now can I go about my rest of my day being humiliated and making calls? Hey guys, this is Bert, and I want you guys to know that you can like, comment, subscribe, and make it happen. And guess what? <laughs> I'll see you on the other side.